All right. I am four hours post surgery. My lovely wife is helping take care of me. Um, my mom said that recliners were more comfy. I'm personally happier in bed. So, it just kind of depends how it feels to you, I guess. Um, as far as pre-surgery, if you've never had surgery, it's, uh, it's really pretty simple. They just do some blood work. Um, do your changing. Make sure that you pass all of your right now COVID stuff and then uh, test your ranges of motion, test your strength in your legs and sensitivity. Um, they do make you push up with the leg that hurts if it's sciatica that's bugging you. That wasn't fun. They told me I could take pain meds before the surgery, but I held off on that. Um, waited until they gave me the meds um, <clears throat> at the hospital. So I quit eating at 10 p.m. Um, woke up at 6, left the house at 6.20, got to the hospital at 6.45, surgery was at 8.30, and then I was out. Um, really funny joke from the anesthesia, the uh, anesthesiologist. He's like, my, my fiance, you know, she gives me a lot of, a lot of crap because, uh, I used to, before I was an anesthesiologist, she says, I was, I used to be the only one that you slept with. <laughs> I'm like, Jesus. Funny guy. Um, I feel good. I woke up feeling good. No nausea, no issues from the anesthesia as far as I, uh, as I could tell. I was up at 1130 and out of the hospital at 215. Um, <clears throat> my throat is rather dry from the freaking breathing tube, so that kind of sucks. My pain in my leg is not a hundred percent gone. It's, uh, I'd say it's about 90% gone. It feels really nice. Like, I wasn't able to lay on my back prior or, uh, lift my leg up. I couldn't fully extend my, my knees for my quads um been flexed by right quad for the last like three months uh for some reason they didn't give me a brace so i'm waiting for my wife's school to pick me up a brace <clears throat> they gave me some hydrocodone and then i do have my medical marijuana card and the pain's really not terrible in my lower back. Actually, I'd say it's about a five or a six. Uh, not as bad as my leg pain was before the surgery, so that's good. Um, waking up though, initially my back really hurt, but it is feeling a lot better, so. My plans and my goals, hopefully, <clears throat> six weeks until uh, I can start ramping up harder physical therapy. This recovery is supposed to be five days no shower, two weeks of no twisting <clears throat> or bending, and four weeks of no lifting more than 10 pounds. So we'll see how that goes. I do feel bad for my wife because she's gonna have to do pretty much everything. Uh, sponge baths for now. So that'll be fine. Uh, as far as after physical therapy, like I was saying goals, I wanna be snowboarding again. So 
Doctor said it'll probably be February. It kind of sucks about three months out, but I recover well from surgery. I'm gonna take it very slow um, and try to get it near the end of January would be nice. So, but that's the good thing is the disc space wasn't terrible. So they said I'll be able to run, exercise, snowboard, uh, lift weights, no power lifting, unfortunately. I could try to push a little bit here and there as far as PRs, but uh, other than that, uh, this next month really is, it really needs a lot of concentration. Um, <clears throat> my younger brother, so I'm 29 years old, my young, 29, yay, pain meds, and my younger brother is uh, 25. He had the same surgery two years ago, and he was jumping in the ocean, twisted around, doing all this stuff about a week after, and now he's got issues. Uh, so set a good example for me that I I really, really need to be strict and mentally strong about it. Um, Got to be humble, too. Really humble. You need help from somebody, and that's that's probably one of the harder parts about this whole thing. But, <clears throat> well, that's much better. All's well. Like I said, I feel really good. Uh, I'm gonna take a nap. I'll keep you guys updated on kind of the progress uh, as far as everything goes. I've never done this, so I hope it helps people. Um, really just, there weren't like a ton of, of videos as far as discectomies, so it's it's not like it was the worst surgery there could have been so yeah I'll, I'll up you guys a little update you guys a little later tonight and keep this going hopefully i can keep the habit throughout all of uh my recovery and then show you guys kind of how i'm doing afterwards as well like i said i want to help help give examples to people Make sure that you guys are like, okay, this is something I do or don't want to do because surgery sucks. Like, uh, really, really sucks, you know. But yeah, that, that seems about it. Other than that, have a quick peek at one of my animals, Marley. Where is she? Marles. There's my baby. Love my lab. Not my beagle as much. Peace.